High and tight. Nope. Oh. The Mentalist, tonight only CBS. All right, here's what you got going on. Highs will reach in the mid-90s this afternoon. Of course, 70s this morning. Uh, the winds are going to be a bit of an issue as well, so keep that in mind. As far as what we're seeing out the door right now, some 50s, 60s, and 70s off towards the north. Same goes for down towards the south, so a little bit of a cooler start for us across the board. We do have... Red flag warnings, which means uh, high fire danger, essentially, because of those gusty winds and low humidity levels. So keep that in mind. Just kind of watch the burning, if you will. As far as what we got across the southwest, we've got a storm system that's brewing off towards the Pacific that's moving on land, and it is going to crank up those southwesterly winds over the next couple of days. The good news is, is it's going to kind of push out this moisture out of the east, so it's been a little bit on the muggy side. We're going to end up with a more of a dry heat, at least initially, then cooler temperatures will be on the way. So so while moist air has been the focus out here in the east with thunderstorms, look for that drier air to really work its way across the state and into Texas as we head into Friday especially. But even today we'll see a little bit of a drying as well with that southwesterly wind picking up. And of course fire danger will be with us as we head into Friday. So here's what you got going on region by region. Highs reaching into the 90s this afternoon. Even a few 80s are on Gallup and Grants. A lot of sunshine, regardless of where you're at today. We could see a spot shower in some areas. I think down here in the southwest, though, it's more or less going to be dry with highs approaching 100 degrees. We'll probably exceed that down here in the southeast to Roswell, Artesia, Carlsbad, Hodge. Just pick your favorite city. Pretty much, if you're not in the mountains, you're going to be up there right around 100 or even exceeding that. In the northeast, could see a spot storm. Temperatures uh, will be in the 90s and 100s, and the winds very gusty around 40 miles per hour at times. For the northern mountains, highs reaching into the 80s and 90s here, but cooler air is on the way. There's your seven-day forecast, Santa Fe, and we'll even see a few 70s, low 70s by the beginning of next week. How about that? That's kind of spring-like, that's for sure. East mountains, high state will climb to the 80s and 90s for the most part with plenty of sunshine. It will be breezy, and back off towards the metro area, topping out into the 90s this afternoon. But again, uh, look forward to the weekend because it is